News Real and Yalik here, Wednesday, April 13th, 2022. Real news, real quick. Texas dropped off its first busload of illegal aliens in downtown Washington, D.C., near the U.S. Capitol Wednesday morning, as Texas Governor Greg Abbott promised last week. The approximately 30 illegal aliens were from Venezuela, Colombia, Cuba, and Nicaragua. U.S. Senator Ron Johnson criticized President Biden and his son Hunter for Secret Service $30,000 per month Malibu mansion next to Hunter's Malibu Sea View home and the agency's cost for following Hunter's wife's trip to Ipanema Beach in Brazil, costing many tens of thousands of dollars. New York police arrested Frank James in connection with the mass shooting, which left 23 injured on a subway train in Brooklyn Tuesday morning. The far Reynosa Bridge along the U.S.-Mexico border remains clogged for a third day amid rising anger about Texas Governor Greg Abbott's ordering extra inspections of commercial trucks to uncover the smuggling of people and contraband. President Biden announced $800 million more of heavy weapons and ammunition to Ukraine today in response to Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky that the U.S. isn't helping enough. France's conservative leader Marine Le Pen, who faces incumbent President Emmanuel Macron in the April 24th runoff election, backed closer ties between NATO and Russia, pledging if she won the presidency, Paris would again leave the military command of the American-led NATO alliance and she would seek a strategic rapprochement with Russia once the Ukraine war ends. Finland and Sweden will decide whether to join NATO, the NATO alliance in the next few weeks. The Centers for Disease Control said on Wednesday it would extend the mask requirement for air travel and public transit for two weeks until May the 3rd. Malaysian lawyers have complained about artificial intelligence programs for sentencing drug offenders. Two courts on the island of Borneo have instituted a pilot test whether AI could work to make sentencing recommendations. One lawyer complained that the AI program resulted in his client getting 12 months in jail for possession of 0.01 grams of methamphetamine. And finally, the Trapp family of Esco, Minnesota, is the tallest in the world, according to Guinness World Records, at an average height of 6 feet 8 inches for the five members. The mom, Chrissy, is the shorty at 6 feet 3 inches, while the youngest, son Adam, is 7 foot 3. And that's the way the world is 